everybody because there must be points when you spend so much time together it must feel like a family and you must think Ugh, actually if I see you again today come on well I think luckily it wasn't a very long shoot so no it was it was really lovely it was we all instantly just clicked and and it was just great to spend time together and, and all working on a project that we really believed in you know it's like it's, it's really exciting when you have four main characters that are so well written um, and, and so complex and, and completely fascinating and particularly to actually get the opportunity to work with another actress in a really, really big role in a film. It's, it's really rare. There are very few films where you get two great female leads in it. Um, so it was, it was very exciting. And I hear that the paparazzi had a field day, obviously, having you two together, yeah. sinking boats to try and get to you. Yes. And we had a boat sank. We had one falling out of a tree. We had actually one of the scenes, we couldn't use any of the sound on it because all you're hearing is, is clicking all the way through. So we had to revoice a couple of the scenes, which wasn't great. But there, there was a point where there were more photographers than there were crew and cast members making the film, which was extraordinary. <laughs> Are you ever tempted to literally get your own crew to show people how bad the other... God, that just really gets complicated then, doesn't it? It but does. I mean, I, I, think, I don't think people realise what it's actually like and what... Yeah, I don't, I don't think people realise where these pictures come from. Maybe it would be fascinating to actually show them. But from personal experience, any time you do try and get a camera out, they sort of... They don't behave in the way that they do when there isn't a camera there. So I don't know whether you'd actually ever really capture what it's properly like hideousness of it yes now um duchess of devonshire yeah the duchess yeah how's that going is that going to be just brilliant i hope so i haven't seen it yet um yes no it, i've got the duchess coming out on oh in september early september which is really exciting um i haven't seen it so i don't i hopefully fingers crossed it'll be good um it's with the wonderful ray fines and and charlotte rampling so yeah hopefully <laughs> i love getting into this whole because obviously in this film you were 1940s all glam ignoring the welly scenes obviously <laughs> but uh, do you like doing that whole dressing up thing? It must be. Yeah, I mean, it's sort of. I just like. I like the idea that you can create completely different worlds. You know, that you can go back in time. That you can try and explore the minds of people that live in a completely different society to the one that you live in. I think that's what I find really exciting about my job, um, and particularly playing these amazing women. You know, and and I think actually, I I just find it very difficult to find really interesting contemporary female roles, and I don't know why that is. Um, and it's obviously not the same for everybody. It's just just for me, but. Um, yeah, no, I, I do really enjoy doing period films. And finally, I have to say, how about Chanel? Because obviously every woman's jealous anyway because you get to dress in it to fire them. Yeah. But how's that going? Because are you moving now? Is it true that Emma Watson's going to be doing 19 and you'll move to something else? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. That's what somebody said. She's very pretty. So who knows? I'm getting lots of shaking heads over there. Yeah. No. No, apparently. We don't know. But who knows? <laughs> Thank you very much. It was lovely Thank to you. meet you. Lovely to meet you too. What, I really cannot wait to see the pictures. Hopefully so it'll good. Good. the costumes um, are definitely great. That's good. It's a great book though.